Hi everyone, welcome back to my tutorial. So in this tutorial, I will try to explain how to create a first TXP portlet in LiveFrame. So in previous tutorials, I have already uh, explained you how to basically install LiveFrame and then uh, uh, create your workspace, LiveFrame workspace. So this is uh, basically uh, the LiveFrame workspace which has uh, been already created in my environment. So this is new in uh, Lifeway DXP which uh, provides the, uh, a single workspace from where you can do everything. So uh, let me just uh, first uh, now create my uh, first portlet so that you can understand how uh, basically what is the process to do that. So just do a right click, new and Lifeway module projects. Just give it a name. New DXP portlet. So you have to by default select project template in project template name MVC portlet. So next, and you have to, if you want to rename uh, your uh, class whatever will be created, you can write it down here and rename the package whatever you want to create. You have to write down here. I will leave it default and just click finish. So you can see it is creating this first template. So in the background, it is using Blade CLI to create this uh, default template of the portlet. And you can see it has created this project new DXP portlet. And you can see it has uh, build.gradle, bnd.bnd and uh, other artifacts needed for uh, portlet creation. Like uh, the class is here and uh, uh, the JSP files which are which were created by default are here and uh, the language dot property is here so let me quickly do some uh, modification so that you can also understand about it and here the main part is this uh, now we since we know that uh, in library DXP is basically uh, the container has been changed or you can say a new container has been introduced uh, that is uh, OSGI container uh, Apache Felix uh, library is using Apache Felix for that so uh, everything uh, everything here is a module basically uh, in OSGI it is everything is uh, using modular structure no. so uh, and this modular structure are bounded using components so uh, when we create a new portrait basically it is creating a module and this module is being uh, uh, registered in OSGI uh, registry using uh, this component annotation now here in component annotation it tells basically the which uh, base service basically we are using in this case it is portlet class and whether and uh, 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 like initially we were using portlet.xml, life portlet.xml, other xml files. So all those has been removed and uh, their properties, corresponding properties has to be written in property uh, uh, tag here. So uh, you can find, I mean as per your need you can find it in uh, developer documentation of the life frame. So let me quickly change something so that you can understand more about it. So I'll just uh, uh,
is it then I'm just going to uh, deploy this you can see in the graded task you can find your portlet that is new DXP portlet and then here you can find these components so you can just quickly uh, build uh, your uh, portlet I can add it from here as well. So you can see my portlet has been started here. This is adding one more portlet which I initially added. So this is my new portlet. So I, I'll just go to Uh, the browser I type localhost colon 800 and login using uh, the admin now I just let me reload this first now I uh, just add my portlet here So this is my portrait which you can see here I just added here you can see now it is showing my portlet content whatever I have added here and uh, here you can see it is also printing whatever I have written in this uh, in the class so this is the way you can create your first portrait in life and also just to show you basically uh, on the back end basically uh, uh, in the Felix console I can show you uh, it has been installed now so to access your Felix console you can just uh, go to your terminal and then type telnet go to host one one three one one it will show you Apache Felix Google Shell. Here, you just uh, you can use lb command to show all the models which has been deployed to your um, OSGI Felix Apache Felix. So this shows me the whole list of whatever uh, component uh, modules has been deployed into it. And you can see in the last it comes uh, the new portlet which I have just added into it okay so that is all thank you thank you so much